The plan for today, guys, is to go and catch as many fish as possible in one hour. What's up guys, it's the Hunter Fisher. Welcome back to another Epi Banger video. Today, guys, we are at a public lake doing a little bit of micro fishing. So right now I have somewhere to be about roughly seven o'clock tonight and I got to be there. But right now it is currently, let's say 5.06 p.m. So there's a very likely chance that I could be late to it, but hopefully I can catch some fish before then. So the plan for today, guys, is to go and catch as many fish as possible in one hour. Hopefully I can get on them. I think I'm just gonna throw some micro stuff today because all I wanna catch is some micro fish to be honest with you i'm really itching for some good bluegill and have not caught a good bluegill in a little bit and i'd like to catch a 10 incher today i don't know if it's gonna be 10 inches we're gonna have to find out on that one i'm gonna measure it with my handle so i can remember that but the goal is today catch as many fish as i possibly can in one hour my buddy's already out of the lake fishing it hopefully i can get in there in time to hopefully get on the fish just like he might be right now hopefully i get enough battery in my gopros because right now i don't have a whole lot of gopro battery and i don't have a whole lot to work with so i'm gonna get out on the water stop talking start to get the fish in by the way guys, I'm sorry for being slow on uploads. College just started back for me, but don't worry guys, I'm going to get back on that train, that grind here soon. I gotta make sure I just gotta get everything sorted out as far as college goes, know what I'm doing in my classes, get a system down packed as to what I wanna do as far as classes and everything goes. So don't worry guys, it's not that I'm you know gonna be uploading once a week all over again like I was last spring. I'm gonna be uploading as two to three times a week like I was this whole summer, and you guys just gotta stay tuned for that. Be patient with me, I will get back to it guys. Enough talking, let's get to fishing. We only have an hour my uh, agriculture class oh, I just cast it off my lure Alright guys, it's been about 30 minutes so far. I've only had a couple of bites, little teensy tiny little bites. So I'm in a spot that I've been consistently catching fish at. So hopefully, I did lose like the last like 1 16th ounce size forehead of the Euro Tackle Softlocks I had. But thankfully, I just ordered a bunch more. But I'm pretty sure I'm about to catch a bunch of fish right here. So let's get to it. I wanted just to show you guys this little spot. It's actually a really cool little spot. So essentially what this is, is like a little kayak pass through. That allows people to like who are kayaking to just pass through this little area. But yeah, I've been out here multiple times on the Pelican and... Uh, a little pond prowler with Parker. Y'all guys have seen it before, so yeah. This is actually a public lake that is actually technically meant for fishing. So I'm here with a couple buddies. I gave it about, what time is it? It is currently 5.49, so it's been about roughly almost 30, 40 minutes now. I'm probably gonna head back at 6.15 and hopefully I can catch a few before that happens. How many fish can I catch in one hour? I'll update you guys. There we go. There's a fish on the mule rig. No, I lost him. Dang it. Dang, that was a little bit like a bigger bluegill or something. Dang. There we go. There we go. I got one. It's a dink. There we go, guys. First one of the day, finally. It's a dink, but you know, all fish matter. <laughs> oh, geez. <laughs> oh, well, I wanted to take a picture of you, buddy. But I guess that's not happening. Whew. All right, guys, we're on the walk back. Currently coming up on the sky bridge. I thought I'd show you guys this real quick and talk about the rigs I was using today. Check that out, guys. That's the lake I was just fishing. Real quick, let's talk about the rigs I was using. I'll tell you guys what I caught fish on today. So around here, rig, first rig I have on is a micro peg float from, uh, or I think it's, yeah, peg float from uh, Mule. Had it paired with the 164th Mule Jig in white, the Donkey Tail Junior, which I actually cut down that Donkey Tail Junior a lot to make it fit better in their mouths, but they still wouldn't bite it no matter what today. Also was using the 10,000 Fish Tataki Frog and Leopard, because I really like this frog. It walks amazingly. To be honest, it's one of my favorite new frogs. And what I caught that fish on today was a 1 16th ounce 
soft lock, Euro tackle, size six hook jig with a one and a half inch B vibe in purple. Y'all know I love that little combination right there. Like I've been telling y'all, Euro tackle always manages to get it done for me. So, and it did so today, which I can actually see people fishing the cypresses right now, which I've done that before. But yeah, you guys seen it always, chartreuse and purple always gets it done, especially in the stained tannic water. And you know, it's just consistent. I'll see you guys back at the truck. I'm gonna talk some more. I'm just tired. Try to hurry up and get out of here. All right, guys, we're almost back to the truck right now. We'll be pushing that time a little bit, It'll be a little bit late, probably like five, 10 minutes or whatever. It's fine, but it's just so funny. When you fish at a public lake like this, you run into the funniest things. Like, pretty sure I just walked by people doing a maternity shoot, which, I mean, no shame in that. That's really cool, but <laughs> I just think it's funny because literally you'll run into the random stuff. Like, remember one time I came out here, and it's just, um, like, I think she was a, uh, she was some type of Asian heritage, and she was uh, playing a what looked like a giant uh, xylophone, and like super mystical in those trees and everything. It was underneath that bridge earlier that I showed you guys, and it's definitely interesting, but it's 6.30. I gotta hurry back to the truck. I'm sweating my butt off. I'm gonna show up to this dinner real sweaty, but it's the first FSU Bass Team meeting of the year, so hopefully we can get to it, which, which before the next video comes out, I'm gonna tell you guys actually what it's gonna be. So hopefully, me and my buddy Tanner, from the bass team are actually gonna go out to this local lake that me and him have never fished before. Well, I think he may have, but I haven't. But we're gonna fish it. We're gonna do a FSU bass team breaks down new lake video. So hopefully we can catch some fish on that and that'll be interesting. But I'm gonna do my outro back at the truck. Yeah, I need to get in cardio again. Oh, let's get back to it. Oh, all right guys. That is it for today's video. We caught exactly one fish and that's okay to be honest with you i'm not expecting a whole ton of fish every single time i go out it's summer and it's florida so fishing is automatically garbage but we're gonna hurry up and get to that meeting that i was talking about earlier in the video i want to say thank you guys for all the support so far expect more videos coming faster and more often to you guys soon because to be honest with the new season of school coming i'm gonna be focusing on videos as much as i can on as i can school school is gonna be my first priority of course but videos are gonna be a very close second because videos you guys have been killing on my videos i've been essentially growing a lot more faster than I really ever expected from you guys and I want to say thank you guys so much and if you guys have gotten this far in the video do me a favor go ahead and hit that subscribe button because we are nearing in faster and faster to my goal I don't think we're gonna hit it exactly I think we're gonna get really close which is fine by me my goal by the end of 2021 is to hit 10k subs guys help me out and hit 10k subs and I would greatly appreciate it. There will be a huge giveaway if we hit 10K subs. I wanna say thank you guys again for all the support you've showed on the videos. If you guys have any questions about the gear I was using today, your tackle, that's about it, really. That's really the most consistent gear for me so far, including Mule Fishing. They have been awesome to me. Both of those companies are really great people. So guys, go check them out in the description down below. If you guys haven't already, go check out my MTB code, Hunter Fish, and also go hit up Carl's. There's a Labor Day weekend sale right now, and if you guys sign up for a free trial, through my link down below, you'll get 30 days free. That means free shipping, everything at the discounted prices that they sell on Carl's. Go do me a favor, go hit that up if you wanna get some crazy discounts. I wanna say thank you guys for watching the video one more time. And remember, wait for it, fish fear me.